Come on in. Hey. How's it going? Europe, that's what's going. Gotta make a quick trip over there. Make sure all your dollars you invested are being put to good use. Bon voyage. Thank you. So, I heard what JR did to you having that kid Asher bash you in the head. Well, I think I can handle your cousin on the sidekick. I'm sure you can. So listen, I'll be in marathon meetings while I'm over there, but uh, meanwhile, Annie's putting out a press release once she gets that party underway. You're coming, right? Your wife's not going with you? That's not a vacation. So you're leaving her alone in that house with Junior? I trust my wife. Hey, what are you doing here? Finalizing the hors d'oeuvre list for my party, please. Jair, don't distract me. Relax, I'm just meeting with my divorce lawyer. Marissa pushed, so I'm pushing back. Just make sure AJ doesn't get pushed, too. I know how ugly these things can get. Yeah, Marissa has to know what happens if she tries to take AJ away from me. I remember going through this with Emma, and I would not wish it on anybody else. I meant what I said before. If you need my support, you have it. Thank you. Hey, I know this is kind of inappropriate timing, but, um, could I ask you a favor? Shoot. I know Scott invited you to our party, but, um, I was hoping you wouldn't come. I... I just think it's best for everyone if you stay away from the mansion. Fine. Really? Then why would I want to be there anyway? Watching Scott trying to impress the board members is not my idea of fun. Scott's not doing this for fun. He's doing this for me. Because he knows what I need. He keeps me grounded and keeps me from spinning off and, and getting lost. I can't afford to do that anymore. Not when I'm so close to getting everything I've ever wanted. For me and for my daughter. I hope that works out for you. What does that mean? Sometimes when you fight so hard for something, and you finally get it, you realize it's not what you really wanted after all. AJ, you know better than to run away from me like that. Sorry, Mommy. It's okay, it's okay. Listen, I need to talk to Asher for a minute, so why don't you go look at the fish, okay? But right where I can see you. I didn't mean to upset AJ. Um, that day at the uh, Wild Winds... When I my son found Caleb on the ground, unconscious, bleeding... After you assaulted him? God, you should be in jail. Is AJ okay? He's still having nightmares. So let's make one thing clear. You will not be spending any more time with him. I get it. Do you? You lied. You made us all think that you were the hero pretending to chase the bad guy away when you were the one who hit Caleb. You ever think he might have deserved it? How could you even say that? You know what? I, I don't even care. Stay away from my son. Is he bothering you? Not anymore. You ready to go, AJ? Come on, sweetie. It's time to leave. Can I go over to Wild when and play computers with Miranda? Sure. Yeah, but why don't we go back to the house and pick up some of your things first? Why? In case you want to stay with me tonight instead of your dad. Why don't you go running back to Junior? Give me a report. Keeping a boy from a father who actually wants him. You don't have a problem with that? My problem's with you. We can get another hearing, okay? Just because the judge denied it. Liza wants to be locked up. I, I can't believe the judge bought her argument. I mean, you had a near-death experience. You, you were unconscious for like a year. It wasn't like you did that by choice. You know, that doesn't make her a flight risk. Liza sees herself as David's Avenger. If I could just talk to that judge again. <sighs> Sorry, Renee. Really gotta go. Rodriguez! Chief. I'll take her downstairs. I thought your shift ended an hour ago. Well, it did, but I figured I'd stick around just in case. All right, then cuff her. Cuff her? Je really, Jesse? Is that necessary? <laughs> Come on. Gotta do this by the book, Ryan, okay? It's okay. 
I'm not gonna help you. I mean, you already have. It's enough. You need to live your own life. I'll see you soon. No, Ryan. Goodbye. What part of stay away don't you understand? Oh, you mean from your little family over at Wildwind? <laughs> Junior must make you feel pretty special, huh? Being his lackey, spying for him. Hmm? Does he make you feel special? Is that what it is? Yeah. Who are you? What kind of man are you running around for somebody else? Who am I? Yeah, who are you? That's a good question. Yeah. It's a good question. The fact is, I really don't give a damn about you. You're nothing to me. My business is with Junior. You just stay away from me and everybody I know. You got that? You're nothing. I wouldn't even think of hiring anyone else to represent me. You know, very few people know that you have a perfect record when it comes to custody cases. You're my secret weapon. It's quite the build-up, Mr. Chandler. But I'm afraid I'm going to have to turn you down. What? Why? I've already been retained by your wife. Well, how does Marissa know about you? I guess she did her homework. My father's the reason you have a career. You'd be nothing without the Chandlers. Where do your loyalties lie? Marissa is a Chandler, too. And she called me first. You dropped my wife as a client? Or you'll never work for the Chandlers again. That's right. You better make sure I win. Honey, run upstairs and get your stuff. Yay, we're going to Wildwood! <laughs> and don't forget to take your pajamas in case you stay with me tonight. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Does JR know you're having a sleepover? Excuse me? I was just wondering if you told AJ's father about your plans. Are you questioning what I do with my son? <laughs> He's JR's son, too. Not that it's any of your business, but I left JR a message on his cell phone. AJ wants to hang out with Miranda. It was his idea. So why don't they just hang out here? <laughs> if it were up to me, AJ would spend as little time as possible in this place. It's toxic. And Wildwind isn't? The home of the man who's trying to destroy AJ's father? It's also Miranda's home, and AJ wants to see her. If JR has a problem with that, you can tell him that I'll see him in court. Um, I don't have time to be your messenger. I'm planning a party. The sooner you're out of here, the better. Hey, 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 she's gonna be okay. No, she's not. She's, she's, she's claustrophobic, okay? Do you have any idea what that feels like for her to be down in that cell like it's, that? Hey, it's not like it's a solitary cell. It's the same one as before. There's plenty of air down I there. I realize that, but she, she knows that she's gonna be trapped there for a while longer, okay? That's gonna hit her on a new level. Just... Let me just let me go down and see her, okay? Let me just help her get adjusted. Ryan? I am the only person that knows how to do that, okay? There's only so much you can do. How do I order room service? <laughs> A sense of humor. That'll be very helpful while you're in here. Hmm. Good Cabernet wouldn't hurt either. Well, it won't be long to your trial. You can count on that. Hmm. Okay, so... I'm gonna go. Or I could stay and hang for a while. Oh, well, that that's sweet of you to offer, but you should be off duty. I gotta get used to this place anyway, so that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. <laughs> 